Hey everyone, what's up? John Chow here from johnchow.com. It's Saturday, I'm here at the Sanctum at the outlet for the weekly self OC calls and coffee. Uh, it's kind of overcast today, not that bright, but which is good for the camera because yeah, you don't want it too bright. But uh, anyway, the show has started like 30 minutes now, so all the cars are already here. So yeah, they're already parked. So let's go check it out. Quite the lineup for coffee today. Wow. Yeah. Here we see the South OC Cars and Coffee merchandise tent, hats, t-shirts, other stuff with uh, South OC Cars and Coffee on it. You know, you can uh, support them by buying some product. And this is the newest sponsor of the show, the BMW Performance Driving School. So yeah, if you want to learn how to drive, drive safely and drive defensively, and drive a nice BMW as well, check them out, BMW Performance Driving School. All right, so here we have the founder, the founder's car, the founder's son's car, another... Hey, how you doing? Poster, Next Level Detailing, they're another sponsor. Poster, Jazz Sponsor, how you doing? All right, so good to see you too. All right, Postar 2, and the cause of share. So you can rent these things. So you just uh, download the share app, at the Play Store or the Apple Store, and then you download the app, and then you can find the Ferrari and, and the Porsche, and you can rent them. Rent them. In fact, uh, yeah, here you go. Here's a QR code. McLaren 600, McLaren 720, Audi R8, and a, a greenish, yellowish green Audi R8. California, which is good, but you know, kind of overcast today. Very family friendly event, as you can see. Another 600. And, oh, check out this Ford GT. Black. Four eight eight, And the Pista. Wow, this is nice. Black with a red and white racing stripe. I know I see the matching interior too, the red and white stripe. You can see it in the seat. Red Alcantara interior as well. Very nice. F12. Yeah, satellite radio antenna. If, if you get a Ferrari, I recommend you don't order a satellite radio because uh, yeah, the satellite radio antenna bump, that is ugly. But maybe that comes standard, I don't know. Every single Ferrari I see here has it. Like here's another Pista, and there you go. The satellite radio antenna. I mean, it, it's basically, it's tacked on, it's ugly, and... But I guess, yeah, well, what can I say? <laughs> Wide body Audi R8, and uh, another Ferrari F12. Really, really cool. I know it's this Ferrari. Painted that too, so. Distinctive. Acura NSX, a GT2 RS, the most powerful uh, Porsche. Yeah. Amazing how fast you can make a Beetle, huh? Yeah. V8 Vantage. 458 Italia, the last uh, natural aspirated V8 from Ferrari. And we have here a supercharged STO Lamborghini. Yeah, check it out. Carbon fiber hood. The roof scoop. Yeah, the, vis the visibility in the back is virtually non-existent. You're not gonna see anything. I mean, how much can you possibly see out there? <laughs> ah. Oh, this is the 991 Touring, the Touring Berg. Yeah, and here we have a Taycan Turbo in really eye-catching yellow. So this is Porsche's uh, electric vehicle. Yeah, cool. So you, uh, Porsche, you have a charging port on this side. You also have a charging port on the passenger side as well. But the thing is, only one of the side is fast charging. So. 
make sure you know what side you're on or else you might be charging pretty slow F8 Tributo Mercer Lago, another 720 with carbon, carbon fenders 992, 911 and another 720 classic car with modern muscle, check it out Corvette power I hope that's not copyrighted music Porsche Speedster in yellow with matching yellow brakes very nice and then we have the Volkswagen version of the Porsche 911 Nissan regular color and Nissan look at me more Volkswagen 911 classic Camaro or oh a V12 S class yeah big monster v12 in this sucker 600 plus horsepower <laughs> pretty good turnout for the show today panamera next to a thing ah check out the new beetle yeah the original beetle was a rear engine rear wheel drive uh, the new Beetle is front engine, front wheel drive, so total 180. And this is the really done out Mercedes A class. Oh wow! <laughs> hey, Campa, check it out. Let's go check it out. Wow, wine cellar, even. Yeah, I love it. The reversible seat. <laughs> Flip down TV. I see a bed up there. Yeah. Yeah. This is ready to go glamping. Oh my god, even a hammock up front. All we need is someone to actually get in it to give it a demonstration. Yeah, I want the keys in my pocket. It's either a hammock or a new hood ornament. Or both. <laughs> uh, this is a cool convertible. Check out the Bronco with the roof remove. <laughs> Check that out. Oh my god, that, that's awesome! This car has seen better days. <laughs> this one, <laughs> Lowrider. Oh yeah, that's it. Convertible Lowrider. Wow. Man, it, look where it comes up to. It comes up to basically. That's that's low rider right there. You know, low rider. <laughs> here's a chopped up high boy. Good thing it has a see-through roof because my head would just stick right to it. <laughs> I would definitely not fit. I mean, look at <laughs> that statue of you. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Yeah, and the shifter is way up there. <laughs> My words. Check out this. Check this out. Check this out. Gas. Gas cap. So you can see it flow down into the tank. My word. Black Betty. And look how tall the wheel is compared to the body. Oh, this thing is awesome. Open headers. Like, you know, who needs a muffler? Yeah, you like it loud. Poly double pumper carburetor with wet and supercharger. And the wheel stuck way up front <laughs> using leaf springs. <laughs> and I don't see any dampers on it, so <laughs> leaf springs, no damper, and 
drum the drum breaks. What is this? <laughs> oh my words. <laughs> it's a mini me. My word, look at that, see? And there's the mini me. Cup holders, suicide doors for the front. I put 268 pounds in Huh, there you go. No, not an Uber. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, slow is all I know. <laughs> hey, slow is all I know. Yes, it's cool as shit. You may pass me, but you won't outlast me. That's um, that's definitely true. My favorite vehicle. It's a Volkswagen thing. I love the fact that you can take down the rear windshield so you can get two wind in your face. Check out this AMG GT. Front spoiler and a big rear spoiler. Oh my. We done exhaust right out the back. Oh. Alright, I'm gonna assume this is the owner. And next to it, <laughs> this pickup truck has an interesting exhaust setup. <laughs> Header right up to the hood. Yeah, sure, why not? I mean, as long as he keeps his glass clean, you know. <laughs> Got this twin turbo setup on this uh, Supra. So you can clearly see the twin HKS turbo. And I know that they're the same size. See, the original Supra motor had two different size turbo. One big one, one small one. The small one comes on early for low boost and then a big one comes on later for the high boost. Uh, he just swapped it for two big ones. So who needs low boost? Only high boost. A little Mazda Miata with an engine swap. I'm talking a serious engine swap. Yeah, so he replaced it looked like a Nissan GTR motor. One big single turbo. Oh, wait a minute. Well, yeah. Crazy. The engine swap. This Ford Bronco <laughs> has a new 5 liter V8. Looks like a Coyote V8. Yeah. Coyote power Ford Bronco. Nice. Lexus LC 500. This is Lexus' sports car. That's really nice. Something distinctive and different. 911 Speedster. And a Porsche GT350 Mustang. And a Porsche GT3. Another GT3. Uh, Hyundai. <laughs> 718, 718. GT3. Old school BMW M3. Audi, McLaren 650, Spider, more GT3. It's into like a Porsche club here. GT3 club. Oh, this is the 992 GT3, the latest one. So it's a good look right next to the two generations ago. So that's the, from two generations ago. That's 99, 991, 992. And here's that one. So you can get a good look at them. You can see the nose. Versus that nose, yeah, and the biggest difference is really in the back, the uh, the wing. So this is a more traditional wing, and the and the new 992 GT3 went to a gooseneck setup. So that's called a top-down wing, top-mounted wing. Generates more downforce that way. Seven eighteen. 991 GT3, Lamborghini, McLaren 600. This one has the optional hood scoop that costs more than a Honda Accord. Yeah, it's like $25,000, $30,000 for the hood scoop, which is a little nuts. But hey, uh, way cheaper than the hood scoop on the Pagani Waiwa. That's 150 grand. And lastly, we have here 765LT in Beautifully, beautiful color combination too, I might add. A lot of carbon option. So it looks like this owner got the full carbon package. There's carbon here, carbon there, carbon, carbon, carbon mirror, carbon roof. That's carbon too. 
carbon spoiler, yeah. Every single piece that could be carbon, this owner got. That's a lot of carbon. <laughs> and over here we got the motorcycle. So you see the rest of the rest of the lot. Uh, guy walking his dog because South OC Cars and Coffee is dog friendly as well. <laughs> so this is uh, South OC Cars and Coffee. Happens every Saturday from 9 to 11. If you're a car enthusiast, this is where you want to be on a Saturday morning. Great way to get some exercise, have a cup of coffee, walk the dog, family friendly, kid friendly. Yeah. Can't can't lose. Oh, wow. Check that out. Check, 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 check this out right here. All right. So I'm going to leave you with this here. It's for sale. It's for sale. So you got this nice customized pickup truck with a drag wheels in the back. Check out the size of those suckers, eh? This huge. Oh, my word. So you got a drag wheel, a cryptid pickup, and it's towing, it's towing the speedboat. It looks like a drag boat. Freedom. So, oh, my. Look at the size of that motor. Uh, so you got twin holly double pumpers, uh, you got a tunnel ram, you got MSD ignition system, and you got open headers. Check out that diff. I see. Yeah, there's a diff to dry shaft going to the back. Single 12 volt battery, and all you need is a foot on the gas. Brakes, who cares? <laughs> and it takes two gas tanks, so check it out. You got the top tank, and you got a bottom tank. Yeah. So, the freedom. You will definitely experience freedom or you will experience death. <laughs> All right, so that's a, that's a pretty nuts. So this is the kind of car you can see at South Post Cars and Coffee. So hey, give me a thumbs up if you like that. Please like and share my video, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys next time.